Well, the Northeast is now Congress mocked with Mizoram bucking the trend in most other states that went to the polls and discarding the incumbent in favor of not the BJP but of the Mizo National Front led by once revered underground Mizo leader Zoram Thanga. The incumbent Congress Chief Minister submitted his resignation. Once a militant, twice chief minister, 84-year-old Mr. Zoram Thanga scripted history today, leading the MNF to a decisive win against the Congress. His supporters erupted in prayers of thanks for divine blessings before hitting party mode. It's celebration time for the supporters of the Mizo National Front. They are back in power after 10 years in this state, and the Congress has lost its last bastion in the Northeast. Perhaps for them, it is an early Christmas. Mizoram is a Christian state. We are a very compact society. And religiously, socially, we are a very compact society. And BJP uh, has no place here in Mizoram during the 10 years of the Congress rule. There was a total, uh, total uh, financial management failure. And because of the liquor sailing, quite a lot of people, thousands and thousands of people died. The Congress crumbled in Mizoram, leaving the Northeast truly Congress mukt. The party got five seats only, and its five-term chief minister, Mr. Lal Thanhaus, lost in both seats he contested. This is very really disappointing. I didn't expect this. I've been ten years here, of course, and I've been chief minister earlier also. I don't know. I think I underestimated the new formation, ZPM, or whatever they call it. For the BJP, a small consolation. One seat in a Christian-dominated state. With Ratnadeep Chaudhary and Sanjay Chakravarti in Aizol, Vijay Kumar for NDTV.